Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Joyce here again for you guys today with another Penny Hose try on video. So, if that's something that you're interested in watching, you should go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Of course, you should definitely hit that bell and also click that like button if you enjoy what you see. And without any further ado, let's get into it. Okay, so today's video is part of my inspired series. Okay, the inspired series is like the name suggests me trying on or styling pantyhose inspired by certain looks that I've seen or celebrities that I've seen try on a pantyhose outfit. So today, today, today is a special one because I have been obsessed with this look, hence why you're seeing me in this two piece. It'll all come together, I promise you. But I saw, whilst I was scrolling through Instagram, there is a model called Cindy Bruner and she had done this amazing look for one of the fashion weeks, I think it was Russia. Actually, she had done two looks. So the first look had her styling polka dot pantyhose, which I definitely was able to do, but I wasn't able to do because they didn't quite have all the right detail for me to execute the look exactly how I wanted to, but they looked stunning with the polka dots. So what I will be trying to do is replicate the second look where she just used black sheer tights and of course I'm a huge fan of black sheer tights anyway so I was just like you know what I think I can do this. So the pantyhose that I'm going to use to recreate the look come from Savage Fenty. Yes, Rihanna's Savage Fenty line. I actually can't remember if I've actually tried these on on this channel. I can't remember on YouTube. If I have I'll link it. If I haven't it's probably across my Patreon or other platforms. So make sure you check out my description section so you can see all the other places where you can find me. Anyway, I was looking through my collection and I kind of thought these would be perfect. They do have a little bit of sass to them. You know, they're written Savage Fenty and they are sheer enough to pull off the look. So here's to hoping. Now I'm just gonna take them out of the packaging. And of course, if you're on my Patreon, you'll get to see the extended version of this video. So make sure you check out the description section for my Patreon details. But I'm going to go through the specs with you guys very, very quickly. I love these. Don't wear them enough. Do not wear them enough. But I counted the other day and I have about 200 pantyhose in my collection. So a lot of them don't get worn enough, you know. But I definitely wanted to pull these out again because they're so good. Now, they're a sheer, they feel like 20 denier. It doesn't actually say on the box, but I feel like they're a 20 denier. They've got a nice waistband. So it's good for cinching in the waist, but it's not too tight where you feel like you can't breathe. So that's useful. I mean, I would have preferred a seamless waistband, but I get it. I get it. And then at the side, this is pretty neat. It actually has etched in the word Savage Fenty in, um, it feels like velvet. I think it is velvet actually, let's call it velvet. In velvet, Savage Fenty, down the leg, super chic, nice little branding detail there, I quite like that. And then the toe doesn't have a reinforced toe, but they are very, very well made, okay? So I really, really enjoy these. If you're ever on the Savage Fenty website, not sure if they're still there, but if they're still there, definitely go ahead and check them out. But I'm gonna go ahead and put these on. Okay, so here are the pantyhose one with the bottoms that I have for this look. Okay, I have also put on the hat because she was she was wearing a very stylish hat, so of course I had to add that little detail on there. But here are the pantyhose on. They have really stretched out to fit so much better than what I remember them fitting like, so I feel like they just needed a little bit of time. Um, I love how sheer they are. They're not the shiniest, but of course that doesn't always matter. I just I just live for them and they also they're made very well. Good quality, a little bit dense, a little bit thick, but not too much. And it does feel really nice on the skin. Now let me show you guys the other side. Ha ha ha. Because this is where it says Savage Fenty. Living for that detail. Look at that. Look at that. Now, when I first wore these, you actually couldn't see the Savage Fenty properly. Um, to be fair, right now, it's actually upside down. Although, I can read it, it says Savage Fenty, but on camera, I'm not too sure what you guys are getting. But I love that. I think it's just really chic. You know, just that little bit of detail. Very, very sexy. So this is what the outfit looks like. In her pictures, she did have the long black coat. I don't have a black coat, so I've just kind of paired it on with what I could find which was a long trench I think it works either way but you guys will have to let me know what you think um, super happy about this outfit I'm living not sure if I could get away with just wearing the <laughs> briefs out with the pantyhose maybe if I was going to the club or something but it's nice either way I think I could probably style this with a pencil skirt what do you guys think nice pencil skirt with a top yeah I think that would work with the pantyhose as well 
yeah i think that would work so hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video make sure you check out the description section once again so you can see all the different places where you can find me make sure you follow me on patreon make sure you follow me on instagram because i will be taking some gorgeous pictures of this outfit hopefully you've enjoyed it once again and i will see you in my next one bye